What's good guys, it's Combat here at Infinite Rhythm Productions and today I'm going to show you guys the most quickest, fastest way to be able to save your playlist so you look dope in front of your clients or to save you time recording your own track. Let's get into it. Combat, this is a banger, huh? So right here we have one of our own producers, Smooth Beats, his tracks. He made a fire beat, let alone a fire song. I'm going to use this one as an example and we just play this out. That shit fire. So this is the quickest, fastest way to save your playlist. Now, a lot of people will tell you to save a playlist. You go over here to the track, you click this arrow, and you click new, or you click duplicate, or you click target playlist, and you can just add it into all these different playlists right here. So when you go to playlist, you'll be able to see it. So just to show you guys, I go new, okay, boom. Now it saves as a playlist. I can now use these parts to comp. You know what I'm saying? It's pretty dope we could just add those things here so playlisting is really sick i'm gonna have a whole nother tutorial on that but right now i'm gonna show you guys the fastest way to be able to do that and this is one of my favorite tricks saves so much time so what's cool about this trick as well is it doesn't just have to be the whole track you could playlist literally if i just want this section all i would do is i highlight the section i want to be playlisted boom boom let's say i want that I hit command E to cut. I then right click the clip right here. I then go to move to and just new playlist. Boom. And as you guys can see, if I go to playlist, it's right here. And every time I do it, it's going to go into a new playlist. If I want it to go to one of the, these playlists, if I labeled it correctly, I could go here and I could put it on the first one. Or I could go here and I could put it on the sec or the second one or the third one. And you guys can see it actually highlights for you where it's moving as well. You guys can see that little blue thing right here that pops up. It's pretty dope. But what makes it super useful is if you guys have like, uh, I work with a lot of hip hop. So if you guys have people that like to punch in, they do like four to fours, eight to eights, even two to twos, two bar by two bars. It just makes it super easy to like, hey, like, okay, let's, let's redo this. Let's do another take. Let's do another take. And as they keep going, instead of having to drag your mouse all the way to the left side, new playlist every time, and it does the whole thing. So you have to keep making tracks. It's just annoying, you know what I'm saying? This makes it so much easier. I just highlight what I want. Let's say it's like one of these clips right here. I already have it recorded. Boom, boom. New playlist. Boom. Let's record another one. Let's record another one. And I'm just saving each playlist so I could be able to comp. It makes it so easy. All right. So that concludes the tutorial today for the fastest, most efficient way to add a playlist. This makes it super easy. And you look dope in front of your client, which is really important. You guys want to keep making your sales. You guys want to keep having these people come in. They want someone that's fast efficient optimizing their workflow and if you guys have any questions about anything else please contact me at combat underscore k on instagram i'm gonna leave the link in the description also you guys record at home you guys will benefit off of my free presets and templates yes you can get free presets and templates for pro tools logic garage band and we're gonna soon have them for fruity loops and ableton as well it makes it super easy with just a drag and a drop. Your vocals could sound clear. We have them free right now as samples. If you guys like them and you guys want to buy the full packs, they are amazing. We have seven different types for each each DAW. We have from stock plugins to wave gold plugins right now. It's a hit every time. Awesome. If you guys could like, comment, and subscribe, that helps me out a lot so I could continue to help you guys out. Let's get it.